I decided to get one more advent calendar. This one is the NYX Advent Calendar 24 day holiday countdown. Every year NYX is releasing three advent calendars, one with 31 doors, one with 24 and also another with 12. The previous two years I bought all three advent calendars and I wasn't happy about them so this year I said just pick one and I decided to get the 24 day advent calendar. This one retails for 55 euros and I'm hoping that it is worth the money about the packaging it looks like a vault with some chains and a belt okay let's open it and we have santa baby also some heels a car pinky is also here with a happy face in the beginning let's go to day number one it looks like a mini lip gloss they always have them in the advent calendars I'm right. This one is the butter gloss in the shade Madeleine and I have it in a full size. This is the shade that I always have in my purse and I love this color. It is super glossy. The full size contains 8 milliliters and the mini 4.7 it is a lot of product but we have started with minis door number two here i'm hoping it is a blush a highlighter oh i'm wrong this one is the this is everything lip loving balm and every year we're getting the lip scrub this time we have the balm most likely we had it last year and I just don't remember. So it doesn't have a scent. Most probably I'm gonna give it to my husband. He's collecting them. We have a nice metallic packaging that you can also reuse after finishing all of the product. And day number three. I'm hoping for a face product. Let's see. Oh no. I'm having deja vu moment from last year's unboxing. And this is the soft matte lip cream in the shade Rome. I have here all of my soft matte lip creams because I'm sure that I have this color and I want to swatch it for you. This is me organizing for a video. Found it! Swatching time! Doesn't have a scent and I'm going to swatch over here because these are some Catrice products from the Catrice DIY advent calendar. I have unboxed it before this video and let's see the color it is very very creamy it also has very nice opacity let's continue with day number four it looks like a mini fixing powder they have a pressed one oh it's an eyeshadow this is a single eyeshadow in the shade working the end pole ah north pole we have this beautiful burgundy pink eyeshadow you can use it on the eyelid for a smoky eye look day number five looks like a full size i'm hoping it is full size maybe it is a lipstick the one with the heart let's see oh wrong this is the matte finish makeup setting spray it can last up to 16 hours and it looks like a mini also the eyeshadow i believe is a mini product it's so cute but why so many minis it's good for traveling i guess moving on to day number six and as you can see all of the doors go in the correct order we want the hassle i'm hoping for a blush they have nice blushes oh wrong again this is a single eyeshadow in the shade through the snow by the name i was expecting a silvery eyeshadow it is golden okay i'm going to swatch it next to the previous eyeshadow it is very beaming nice this is not very opaque you can also use it to highlight your face if this can match your complexion after that day number seven it looks like a mini product again yeah pinky gets angry this is the hd studio photogenic eyeshadow base we have 4.7 milliliters it is definitely a mini product i never use products like this i'm always applying concealer on my eyes this one doesn't have a lot of coverage i don't know how you can use it on the eyes here we have day number eight another eyeshadow i think we got exactly the same colors last year as well i just i can't find the single eyeshadows from last year's advent calendar this is a single eyeshadow in the shade toy why are you heart heart i'm going to swatch it Ooh, super shiny very very nice formula 
After that, day number nine with a mini lip product. Is this the mini advent calendar? This is a soft matte lip cream in the shade Budapest. This is the previous color that we got. What is happening? They're not exactly the same, but they are so close. Okay, let's swatch this one. It's a dark wine color. It's gonna look super nice with just eyeliner on the eyes. Up next, day number 10. Maybe a small eyeshadow again. Whoop, I'm right. We have here the single eyeshadow in the shade Hot Like Cocoa. And it is a beautiful light brown shade. It's very, very soft. It doesn't have the intensity that you see in the pan. But at least we have a crease color to use with all of these beautiful, luxurious, shimmery eyeshadows that we got. Let's go now to day number 11. Ooh, another eyeshadow. This is the single eyeshadow in the shade Rapper of the Year. And we have a dirty gold eyeshadow. This color's... Oh my god, it's so beaming. I was gonna say, this type of color never looks nice on me. Oh, yeah. This can work. <laughs> Not bad. Very, very nice shade. I wish that we had the palette instead of the mini eyeshadows. This is day number 12. I'm going to say a mini butter gloss. <laughs> Am I right? No. I was close with this lip product. We have here the soft matte lip cream in London. <laughs> this is a French reference and I'm curious to see if I have the shade again. Yeah, I have it in a full size. So I'm going to swatch this and again. This is how the sizes are. In London, this looks very similar to the eyeshadow. It is a nice light beige lip color. I'm curious if they're going to discontinue the soft matte lip creams. And that's why we got so many. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Here we have day 13. It looks like an eyeshadow again. What is going on? So many single eyeshadows, soft matte lip creams, and we have here the single eyeshadow in the shade Workshop. Not Workshop. It looks super delicious as well. Ooh. Oh, it's beaming. So stunning. This eyeshadow can look super fabulous on top of a darker eyeshadow base like black, brown, purple. Yep. Door number 14 is here. It looks like a mini butter gloss. It is a soft matte lip cream. I already have it. Let's swatch mine. It has this beautiful pink peachy color that I love wearing every day. This is gonna look awesome on any skin tone. And then we have door number 15. It is gonna be an eyeshadow. I'm so excited. And pinkies too. This is the single eyeshadow in the shade Down to Dash. It is a very light shade. I don't think I can use it as a crease color. Also, it's not noticeable on me because I have a yellow undertone. So if you have a warmer undertone, maybe you can use this eyeshadow to set your concealer. I don't like using eyeshadows to set my concealer because I feel it makes my eyelids heavier. Door 16. It's a bigger. Maybe we have a primer. Oh, another spray. It is a dewy finish makeup setting spray. So we have a matte and also a glowy. This can last also up to 16 hours. And it is super mini. How much product do we have? 18 milliliters. It's so tiny. So we didn't get even one full size product. And I don't know if the lip balm is a full size. It contains 9 grams of product. So let's continue to the next door. 17 is down here next to Santa Baby. I don't think it is an eyeshadow. I'm gonna say a butter gloss, a mini butter gloss. It is again a soft matte lip cream. Okay. I don't have it. I don't have it in this video. It is the soft matte lip cream in the shade Instabool. And surprisingly, I don't have this color. They didn't have it again in an advent calendar. Oh my god, it is super girly. We have this beautiful bubble pink. 
and it is nothing like the packaging i'm so happy because this color is gonna look terrible on me i absolutely love this color let's go to the next door day number 18 i'm going to say a single eyeshadow oh no and we have here the hashtag this is everything lip scrub and i had this again with a different curved packaging yeah they have changed it we had this in all of the last year's advent calendars let's go to day number 19 okay i'm going to say a soft matte lip cream it's a butter gloss <laughs> it's a butter gloss this is the butter gloss in the shade vanilla cream pie i'm super excited to swatch it i have never tried this before it is a super girly pink lip shade it can go very well with the previous soft matte lip cream i really like this one next we have day 20 it is definitely a mini lip product okay butter gloss or soft matte lip cream butter gloss all right <laughs> We have here the butter gloss in the shade Rocky Road. I'm very curious to swatch it because I have never tried this shade. It is gorgeous. This is a luxurious dark cherry red lip gloss. I can't wait to use this. I have tried some other darker shades of butter glosses and they look awesome on the lips. And day 21 here. Oops, I forgot to say. And we have here the butter gloss in the shade Cinnamon Roll. I love brown lip glosses and lipsticks, as you can see. I love that we have a cool undertone. In the market, you can find easier warm tone lipsticks, lip glosses and lip liners, but cool tone, nowhere to be found. This would definitely look amazing with my lipstick today. Yes. Up next, door 22. I don't think it is a full size. I wish that we had some of the new makeup releases that they had this year. They have new lip glosses, new lipsticks, new lip liners, eye products, eye pens. Sales. we got the same variety as last year's oh my god this again <laughs> this is the born to glow liquid illuminator in the shade gleam it is a liquid highlighter that we get every year in every advent calendar by nyx so we have six milliliters and i brought mine which is the full size 13 milliliters here so i'm going to swatch the full size oops that's a lot this one is a rose gold liquid highlighter that can look better on darker complexions for example on me it's not gonna be very noticeable and let's let's find door number 23 i'm going to say a blush <laughs> another mini this is the hd finishing powder it is mineral based in the shade translucent and i have tried it again it is actually a nice setting powder it doesn't dry the face also it doesn't give a white cast it contains 3.3 grams of product it's not the full size this advent calendar is allergic to full size products <laughs> So let's continue to day 24. It looks like an eyeshadow. <laughs> a single eyeshadow. <laughs> Found it. We have here the single eyeshadow in the shade Reindeer Coat. And it is a beautiful chocolatey brown matte shade. Let's swatch it and see the pigmentation. Delicious. Okay, it looks very nice in the swatches as well. It has a very nice opacity. Something that I don't like about all of the single eyeshadows is that it doesn't say NYX Cosmetics on the packaging. So they specifically made these small eyeshadows for the advent calendar. It is a little bit cheapish. I'm very disappointed with this advent calendar. All the products are minis. If you bought the last year's advent calendar, most likely you have all of the products because it is the same advent calendar i'm gonna give it two stars and you can watch next this video here